It's very important for Palestine to be uh, present in Expo 2020 Dubai, especially since it's the first Arab country that hosts Expo. As Palestinians, we're very proud to be here, representing our country and representing our culture and traditions. The vision of the Palestinian Pavilion in Expo 2020 Dubai is the history, the present and civilization and the future of uh, Palestine. So through the different uh, aspects that we portray through the pavilion here, we try to port show our history, especially through uh, the entrance of the pavilion where we show the old city of uh, Jerusalem, the capital of Palestine. We move on to show how the uh, present is uh, in Palestine today through the videos, through the uh, different items that we have here in the pavilion. The inspiration behind the design of the pavilion was uh, a national Palestinian team that worked on the idea of the pavilion. The stone that uh, uh, people would be standing on in the pavilion are a uh, Palestinian stone that we brought all the way from Jerusalem. We uh, based pa the pavilion on the five senses. So uh, they come here, they uh, get introduced to Jerusalem, the capital, then they go to experience Palestine through seeing it, through hearing it, through uh, touching, smelling and virtually tasting it. Now in the sea area we have a, a video about Palestine that shows the different sectors, economy, agriculture, tourism, sustainability. When you move to the hearing section, they hear different sounds from Palestine, the call to prayer, the church bells, a poem from the Palestinian, late Palestinian poet Mahmoud Darwish, كانت تسمى فلسطين. كانت تسمى فلسطين. صارت تسمى فلسطين. In the touch section, we bring very valuable items from Palestine. You have the key of return. For all the way from 1948 and it's the key of return because it hopes that one day we will use these keys that we used to lock our doors in 1948 when we were exiles to open them again in the future. We have an actual piece from the Dome of the Rock, an aluminum piece, when the Hashemite Kingdom of Jordan renovated the Dome of the Rock in 1994, an actual piece uh, of salt from the Dead Sea, and from the oldest city in the world, Jericho, you have Hisham's palace built by the Umayyads, you have an actual mosaic piece that we brought all the way from Jericho to here. In the smell section, you smell different aromas from Palestinian land. And then through the virtual taste area, you sit on a huge table that represents how Palestinian you know, dinner would look like. And it's very important for the person to actually feel that they've been to Palestine, which is why we put the VR. In the VR, you walk through the Al-Aqsa Mosque in its entirety, or the Church of the Holy Sepulchre, both in uh, Jerusalem. And usually people spend a lot of time there, and this concludes how uh, it would feel to actually visit Palestine. So we brought a piece of Palestine to people who can't uh, go to Palestine. In the pavilion, towards the end of the tour, people will find a gift shop. And in the gift shop, they are all uh, items and products that we brought all the way from Palestine. Uh, also, when people come to the pavilion, they always tell us that they smell the uh, smell of za'atar. And we immediately tell them that this is from our Mama'ish restaurant. They actually have a stone oven. They make all the Palestinian uh, Mama'ish. And of course, all the ingredients that they use are grown in Palestine. I think uh, what's special about Expo in this region is that it's the first Expo in the Middle East and North Africa region. It's the first Expo that combines all countries and it's important for Palestine to also be part of it just to continue the legacy of uh, always participating in the uh, previous Expos. So what uh, Palestine is hoping to achieve here is to uh, connect more with uh, different countries from uh, all around the world, just to be able to uh, build out more opportunities with different uh, uh, countries, whether it's investment, tourism, etc. And we also hope to uh, educate also the visitors about more about Palestine, what we have in Palestine, and what they might see if they actually get the chance to visit our country. Come to Expo 2020 Dubai, specifically come to the Palestinian Pavilion. We're sure that you leave with a smile on your face. Happy New Year and Merry Christmas from the Palestinian Pavilion. We hope that you have a great year ahead and a very lovely Christmas.